Now, REACH Incorporated in Bozeman provides a number of services for adults with developmental dis disabilities living in the Gallatin Valley. MTN's Gabby Krevit has the story on how the organization worked around the COVID-19 pandemic to, to make sure they could still host one of the area's favorite 4th of July traditions. REACH Inc. held its 13th annual Race for Independence run, but this year it was held virtually. And this is another example of how the organization is working hard to protect their clients during the COVID-19 pandemic. The botters started the run from their driveway. Firecrackers signaled the start of the race and they were on their way. We are doing the REACH Race for Independence today at home to be social distancing from everyone else. The event is usually one of the biggest fundraisers for REACH, which provides residential, vocational, and transportation services for adults with developmental disabilities in the Gallatin Valley. REACH Inc.'s Community Relations and Development Director says this year the event had to be reimagined in order to keep clients safe and to do their part to reduce the spread of COVID-19. It's an important event partially because it helps us um, get people information about what we do, especially because our clients get to be part of it. Also, you know, we need funding. There's a lot of challenges with COVID. There's unexpected expenses. There's a reduction in our income for so many different reasons. COVID-19 has posed many challenges for REACH's clients. Since since many have health conditions that make them more vulnerable and safety protocols have come at a high cost. They love their families and they miss their families and they have not been able to visit with their families since early March. We have to keep them safe and there has been ad advice from the Gallon County Health Department not to have visitors. We're following that advice. The Botters joined over 100 participants in the virtual run and all agree now is the time more than ever to show their support. Well, we're pretty dedicated to REACH in general. I feel like they do a great job of supporting their clients and um, getting them independent and the ability to have them be pro productive members of society. Another way you can help support REACH Inc. is by donating PPE. That includes gloves, gowns, goggles, and most importantly, surgical masks. Reporting in Bozeman, Gabby Krevit, MTN News. All right, what an inspiring story. Thank you, Gabby.